Hello everyone, this is Chi. Welcome to my channel and today we're here for another vlog. Our first vlog on what I'm going to call the summer series. Originally this was going to be a series of vlogs during June, preparing for Camp Down Rhyme in July. And then all through July, while I wrote in Camp Nano, I planned on doing a 50k in Camp Nano to check whether the burnout I got from NaNoWriMo last year was because of the words or because I was doing that at the same time as I was studying but then I got a job and I'm going to be working 40 hours a week all of June and then half of July for the first time in my life I've never worked 40 hours a week like I've had a couple one day jobs like I just had conjunct for one day, I had to do this one specific thing during X, X amount of hours. I've held mostly at a bar, but I had never done something like this. I haven't started yet, today is the 30th of May. So I don't think I'm going to do Camp Nano this month. Because for, I mean, I don't even have a project, like, I haven't thought of a project I want to do yet. Like, I have a lot of projects, obviously, but I haven't cho chosen one yet. And then, I don't know if I'm going to have the time to prep for it, to enjoy, because I'm not used to working 40 hours a week, and it's divided between morning and afternoon, slash, kind of evening, it goes into the evening a little bit, and it's a little bit far from my house, like not too far, but I do have to take a uh, public transportation and that's going to take a lot of time too. So I don't I'm not going to have a lot of free time during the week. And I don't think I can prep for a whole 50k just during the weekends. So we'll probably just be working on random projects here and there and not participating in none at all. That being said, I do have several projects I want to work on this summer. First of all, I want to work on a comic I was drawing, a webcomic based on the light novel series Maho Soju Ikusei Keikaku, which translates to Magical Girl Racing Project. I started this webcomic last year. I did only two chapters, the prologue, which I did last summer, and then chapter one, which I ended on January, I think, and I want to keep working on it. So I was planning on at least getting like the script down for it. But I, I mean, I have August as a free month, like holiday, vacation, whatever. But then when my classes start again on September, my job also starts again. So I won't be able to do that much either after that. Just, I really only have like half of July and then August to do stuff and the weekends here and there. Not really because I am also playing d and I have a new players group which I joined because I haven't played never and I wanted to like learn how to do it. And then I joined the campaign which since I'm in Europe and the rest of the players and the DM are in America I have to play at 5 a.m. So yeah, that, that's not a lot of fun for me. I mean, it's really fun, I love it. We've only had one session so far. I think we will have had two by the time this goes up. But anyway. And I'm also looking into starting a in-person group, like in-person campaign where I would be DMing. So that's a lot of extra work for me. And I'm not really sure how well I'll be able to do all that stuff and then keep up with a lot of projects. But yeah, I want to work on the Mahoiku one. Then I also want to work on a game. A game I started making, not playing a game. But I started making a game and I did like a demo version that I gave my best friend for her birthday last year. And I want to keep working on it. And like, it's a game about people trapped in a building and they go like floor by floor clearing it and they have to escape they have to find 
nine red key keys and they had explored all the floors yeah so the demo was the first floor the floor the characters wake up in and i think i want to like make the next floor and then give my friend like all of that to play and then eventually i'll do the next floor and give her all of that and keep going up until we have the whole building and the whole story like working floor by floor so i would like to get the next floor done this summer i think i may be able to do that i've been planning for it you'll see me do some of that and of course i'm also going to keep drawing the i mean if i see i don't have the time for all of the other projects drawing is the one that's that i'm going to keep it's going to be like a priority so the other two projects if i don't have the time i won't do them but drawing i will keep at least unless i think it's just too stressful and i have to get rid of all the projects for the time being and just focus on working which i hope it won't come down to that but we'll have to see so yeah those are like the three main projects i'll be working on you could say and yeah right now i've been kind of preparing some stuff for the game to work on the game and i will keep blogging i will tell you every day if i've worked on x project or the other one or whatever i'm telling you today i've drawn and i worked a little bit on the game i can tell you more about the game if you want to know about it but yeah it's monday the 30th of may and i love that you tomorrow tuesday 31st last day of may right before june i'm excited for june like i started working on this sex and then i'm excited for it because i'm working on the same thing i'm studying for it's just i don't know kind of a collaboration between my school and this one i forget how to talk but yeah it's kind of a collaboration so since i'm studying for that my school got me a job on that because i was the person with the top grades in my class so yeah i'm excited for it but i know it will take a lot of time from my day and it will probably be very stressful for me since i'm not used to this and we'll have to see how well i keep up with everything maybe next week when i start i will just come in here and tell you i'm just too stressed out and i can't keep blogging and i can't draw and i can do absolutely anything except work eat and sleep i'm hoping it won't happen but i mean if i think of the worst i can't get disappointed and be even more sad or whatever because i'm really expecting it to be really bad You know, it's the 31st, Tuesday, and today was the last day of May, so I gave my best friend the last drawing, which you would have seen on the 6th of June, I think, yeah, that's the day that video goes, goes up, and I'm, like, not even, not even a full day away from June, and I still don't know if I want to be planning for a project of Camp Nano because on the one hand I got an idea I could maybe try to work on different projects like get to 50k but with different projects and that would fix the issue of not having a project to write that would have enough, enough story for a full 50k you know but then at the same time, I don't really have that many projects I want to be working on right now, or I do, but then I have like the main idea and I don't really have anything else thought of, and I don't know if I can just plan the full, full stories during June while also working 40 hours a week, and then comes the problem of working 40 hours a week and doing a nano. Because, I mean, I would only be working for half the month 
so I could potentially fix that any like if I'm behind I could potentially fix it during the second half of the month but I'm not sure I haven't done anything yet today I just did a drawing because that's what I do we're at 182 drawings right now and almost 500 prompts excluding the ones from Mermaid so yeah we have a lot of stuff to draw I don't plan on drawing it right now all at once but there's a lot of it and um, yeah I'm working on my game right now I worked on, on it a little bit yesterday and I plan on working some more of it but I don't know like should I just stay with my drawings and my game or even just my drawings or should I actually try to push it to be able to work on something this come nano? I don't know. I'm really indecisive. And I do have a project, a fantasy project, completely original. Not completely, because nothing is 100% original, you know, but not from fiction, I mean. And I wanted to work on it as a story. I also wanted to work on it as a game or as a manga. But I'm still not sure which of those options would work best, so I could potentially try to write it. But we come to the same problem of having to write 50k. I think that project could reach 50k, but I don't know if I would be able to actually work on that. And I have a lot of ideas I've been collecting over time, but I don't have anything like planned for it. And I don't know if I can plan all of it or enough of it during this month so working on my last NaNoWriMo project could work but maybe I don't know if I don't know if that's a good idea because I don't want to go back to, get, to it yet and like I'm still tired from it you could say so I don't want to actually go work on it even though I didn't finish the story, I just reached 50k and stayed there. So I don't know, I'll have to keep thinking about it and keep updating you, I guess. For now, I'm just going to get a snack and to work on my game some more. So it is Wednesday, the 1st of June. I still don't know what I'm going to do about Camp Nano. And I've been working on my game. I did three drawings today and then I started working on the game. I I have done like a third maybe of the floor. Or it could also be a half because I'm not sure. Okay, so there's ten characters and eight of them are in the same floor, but two of them are in a different floor. So I'm not really sure. If I should include the part of the story that goes on with those two characters on the different floor as part of the same, like, part of the story, because technically it's all happening at the same time, but they're on a different floor and I'm doing this, like, floor by floor. So I'm not really sure if I should include it at the same, like, part of the game, because I was going to send my best friend this part, like, this floor, but it might include two floors or I could separate it and then send her this only this floor and then the other two characters on the different floor would be the next update you could say of the game so I'm still not sure what I'm going to do with that because if I separate it then I've already done like half of the story and the whole floor is designed already so that would be like more than half really done because I would only need to do like this story that's left of the other like half of the party that like, it's separated like the group separated into two parts so I don't know what I'll do I still have time to think about it and I don't know what I was saying because my brother came in but anyway so yeah I'll keep you updated for now I'll just keep working on it I'll do the part that's left that's actually on the same floor and then I'll ponder whether to include the next part or just send that to my best friend and work on the next floor somewhere 
on the line sometime maybe never maybe in a year who knows because the first part I sent to her I finished it on September and I showed it to her on November for her birthday so yeah it's not quite a year but like nine months since I finished that part and I didn't work on it like ever again so we'll have to see I mean she probably won't have to wait a lot more maybe a full year not that much it is Thursday the second and I just finished my game like not my full game but the whole the floor I was working on and I decided to separate this floor and the part that happens with the other characters who are on a different floor so I will send my best friend what I've done up until now now and then for her birthday on November I will send her the full part with what happens in the other floor I decided to do that and now I think like seeing as I've done in two days what I didn't in nine months I think maybe I will be able to write on July and like I visited my new workplace and I I saw they have like a break room and they don't really like do anything there other than like eating lunch because the morning shift ends at 1.30 p.m. and then the next one starts at 4 p.m. and I have to be on both so I have like two hours and a half that are free and that I would spend there eating lunch and doing whatever because you don't eat lunch for two hours or I could come home and eat here because like I can't I have the time like, because like subway takes like not even half an hour so I could come home but I th I'm thinking maybe I could spend that time riding or doing something else and then when I come back home at night I can ride I mean I don't know if I'll have the energy because I don't tend to wait until night to ride because I don't usually have the energy as I've said to do that so I would have to see but I mean considering it's not even the full month that I would have to do that I could potentially just try it out on first and if I start getting behind I can just compensate for it later so I think I might try to do the 50k for July and actually participate in Gandano. but the thing is I still don't know what project to work on like I could try to work on my original story and check whether it's like a good idea to write it out or it fits better as a manga or as a game but if it doesn't work I can, I don't think I will be able to write 50k with it and I still I haven't prepped anything for it yet I don't have many I mean I have many ideas but I don't I haven't like developed any of them before I would have to prep a lot for it and I do still need to prep for DMing a D&D group which I don't even know if I'm going to have it because none of my players have gotten back to me about it I mean I could also try to like write stuff for that campaign or if it doesn't work as this campaign like for a future one but I mean I don't think I can write 50k about that either so I will have to keep thinking now it's second I hope we don't stay like this until like half of June has passed because then I won't have time to prep for anything I should probably start trying to prep for something and then just if I don't think I'll prep for it on time either I'll discover it right there in July or try to go for something else that won't take as long I don't know I guess I'll update you tomorrow what I'm thinking I mean, I haven't changed my mind all that much the last few days but we started as me not wanting to try and now I want to try 
maybe by tomorrow I will have chosen something. It is Friday, the 3rd of June. You would have seen a tiny little small clip of my breakfast. And yeah, I've been working this morning. I had to record some sort of like end of a gameplay of my game for a friend because he wants to see the game but he can't play it because he doesn't have a computer. And I found some errors so I was working on fixing those. Luckily they were easy to fix and very minor errors but I just, I don't know, I noticed them and I want to get rid of them because I want my game to be as good, as perfect as, they, as it can be. I also did the closed captions for a video that will be going up eventually. That was my 20 minute of working sprints. I don't know if it, I don't think it's up yet. Let me see. No, it is not yet, but I think it will be going up next week now. The week after that, so Monday to the 20th. But yeah, now you have a spoiler, you know, I'm posting a 20 minutes of working sprint video in like two weeks. But yeah, I'm trying to pre-record stuff, so I work on that. I also like scheduled what things I wanted to post when and when I would be recording those. And now I'll be spending the rest of the day mostly working on my characters, on my main characters for the fantasy project I'm trying to prepare from Camp Nano. I, well, I have an event for my brother. My brother is participating on a, like, sports event and I have to go to that. But yeah, so that's it for my day today. It is Saturday the 4th, it is 3 a.m., 3.15, and I'm not really going to explain why I'm vlogging at 3 a.m., because I'm going to be vlogging today as a day in my life that will be going up, like, in the future, at some point. But yeah, right now I'll have a D&D session, and then we'll go back to sleep. And tomorrow, well, tomorrow, in the morning, you know, I will be working on my Camp Nano project. I'm done with the main characters, like, they have their own character sheets, you know. But I still have to work on the story, obviously. So yeah. It is Sunday, I have no idea what day it is. Probably the 5th, I think. Yeah the last day of the vlog and today I've been already working on my Camp Nano project I I know yesterday I recorded the day as a day in my life I know I said today was, I was going to hang out with some people, with some friends but I didn't do it because I go with my brother and my brother was stupid and got in trouble with our mom and I decided to stay home too since he wasn't allowed, allowed to come with me anyway but yeah, so I've spent my day mostly working on my story for Camp Nano. I've been drawing the characters. I only have one of them left. Like, I mean, there's three main characters. And there's one left. I took a shower too, because tomorrow I start working my 40 hours a week. I mean, I'm hopeful that it'll go well. And I'll be able to keep working on my projects. I'm also kind of scared. But we'll have to see. But yeah, so I'm going to finish off the vlog here. This has been everything. I hope you liked it. Leave a like, a comment, you know, as always. Subscribe if you think my channel will be of interest to you. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye bye.